Hello friends, I am Pia Lee and I love to build community networks and groups. Discuss Agile is a community network where we help people in learning and implementing Agile. And in that process, we keep doing many events like meetups, web sessions and workshops as well. Recently, we had a great meetup on Agile implementation and learning. Now let's have a look what participants are sharing about their learning and experiences from that discussion. Yes. Yeah. Okay. Uh, so uh, my takeaway is the one which you have told about the football game, how to relate it with the retrospective. That's a very good point. And the second one, uh, the second, uh, I mean, uh, the takeaway is like the, the, I mean, the distributed, I mean, in distributed environment, how we are going to work as a team and the activities which is involved in the distributed, I mean, when we are doing a distributed type of uh, retrospective or something. Thanks for that. The best takeaway is about the experience of many guys here, so that you know, we learn a lot of things from each other. And uh, the most thing we like is about, you know, making uh, the team from good to great by using, using retrospective as a forum to make a great team. First uh, takeaway is uh, basically like uh, limit the outcome of any retrospective to two, three top important items so that no like the essence of uh, that retrospective is maintained. The second most important thing is how to use some tools for managing a distributed uh, retrospective. Thank you. So I really enjoyed discussing retrospective. Uh, my takeaway is that uh, I haven't done too many retrospectives. But I have learned quite a lot of experience, so I can take away this uh, experience with me. And when we start with uh, retrospective, I can use this uh, whatever I learned from today. Great gathering and uh, lots of different views on the retrospective, how each of us take it forward. Uh, lots of techniques been discussed. I think I need to go and check out one by one to see which works fine. Um, really good. Thanks for making it happen. Yeah. So good gathering and a lot of different, uh, you can see with a lot of common issues but a different way to tackle it. So a lot of different ideas and uh, live experiences are shared. Um, so a good, good take away from this. Uh, multiple minds coming together discussing uh, and brainstorming over a problem and a solution to it. Uh, actually enables a lot of sharing of experiences and that way we learn more than what we have experienced or what we have thought of and uh, uh, one of the key takeaways for me is probably how to deal with uh, cultural uh, differences in case of a distributed team. Though I have a distributed team, uh, probably I have been lucky that I did not actually face uh, one such issue. Maybe next time when I do, uh, I, I at least have something uh, that someone else has tried and shared with me. Yeah, it's a wonderful uh, Friday evening. Uh, I'm meeting for the second time for this venue. And uh, I believe in uh, learning and sharing. I think which really happened uh, today evening. And uh, I shared whatever I have been experiencing and I learned from this wonderful people to hear. And uh, thanks for this opportunity. Uh, thank you very much for facilitating this. Uh, it was a great event, a great learning. Everybody has very valuable inputs that we can definitely use in our day-to-day -day activity and improve our retrospectives. Thank you. Had a great time. What I take is like set the stage properly and bringing some innovation and activities to, so that uh, we will make it more interesting, more effective and we will get rid of the bottom in the, of the retrospectives. It was a wonderful evening with so many people and learning so much from so many people and knowing also and some of the people have made it a second time also so that's a wonderful thing. Apart from that one as everyone is saying it's a very good learning experience with everyone. It's not the every problem which I face is I need to face sometime in future probably and it's good to know those problems up front so you can prepare yourself better and thanks at the product. Okay. It was a very good session. Uh, my takeaway is I learned so many experiences from so many people here and learned new, new techniques on how to do the retro retrospectives. Thank you, Sajid Brother. Thank you. <laughs> so, my experience finally. Yeah. It's my work. So, what I have learned yeah. for this particular session is that it's a great way to organize things if you have some structure in place. The ball does help. Okay.
जाने दो काट देंगे so uh, my my personal experience is it was a great event thanks to organizing things the ball did help and i learned a lot related to retrospective because uh, many times the theory doesn't work in practice so we talk about senior people attending retrospective people walking out from retrospective these kind of things you will never hear till the time people share their own experience so I, I believe in unconferencing concept where you don't learn from one speaker because if there are multiple speakers, that the knowledge is unlimited. So whenever we go to a single speaker based event, there will be always a limit. So that was my attempt to make it kind of unconference, and I feel I am satisfied with that. Thank you. <laughs>